Good evening, I'm Emily Ashby. And I'm Alicia Carthel. And, and this, this is, is Color Chronicles. Chronicles. Now we're here tonight for the premiere of Spike Lee's film Inside Man and to kick off the Murray State Spike Lee Film Festival. And in just a few minutes we'll have some interviews from people walking our fabulous red carpet. And hello, I'm back. I'm Alicia Carthel, and I'm here with Dr. Cynthia Gaiman. She is a professor of philosophy here at Murray State University. Uh, Dr. Gaiman, what were your thoughts about Spike Lee coming to Murray State University? Oh, I was uh, really surprised, first of all. Um, I'm amazed that Murray State would bring Spike Lee here. I'm really, really excited about it. And uh, I organized my um, introduction to philosophy class kind of around this, so we immediately jumped into social political philosophy. Right now we're uh, reading Martin Luther King, letter from the Birmingham jail. Okay. Um, I'm requiring students to come to this film series. I am so excited about it. Dr. Robertson, when you hear the name Spike Lee, what's the first thing that comes to mind? Well, let me tell you, the first thing that comes to mind is that he's going to be a great role model for those that want to go into the film business. And I have a personal interest in that because my son has just graduated from the University of Southern California, a degree in film production, and his goal is to be a producer. So I need for Spike Lee, Spike, I need for you to help him out and give him some uh, some connections and, and help him uh, get into the profession. Um, I was very excited. I think it's a great thing that he's come in. Um, and I think he speaks for all for MSU as far as um, diversity initiatives. I think it's, it's, a, it's a great thing that he's coming. I was ecstatic. I was really happy. Um, I was um, excited to um, attend the event. Um, I thought it was something that was long overdue. Um, I thought it would be a great opportunity for students on campus to get an, an inside uh, look of who he is outside of a dir director. Everybody on campus was looking forward to it, like the campus is jumping, like it, it's so exciting, you know, to finally see Spike Lee in person. I was thrilled. I was very excited that he was coming to have a director and a producer of this caliber coming to Murray State University. I was floored. I was really excited and I'll be even more excited when he finally comes and presents his lecture series. Very excited. Uh, I know Spike is a cultural icon. I, I remember him back from the Nike Air Jordan days mm -hmm. and the, the Brooklyn commercials uh, and have always enjoyed uh, hearing Spike's opinion. He never uh, minces words and he's always ready with that opinion and I, that's what I value about it. He is a great speaker. Um, what is one of your favorite films that he's done? Uh, one of the, probably the film I've seen the most of his is He Got Game. Uh, you know, uh, it's a great story. Ray Allen plays as a basketball player and high school basketball player just making a college decision and working in higher education. Uh, that recruiting process and the college athletics is entertaining and I think Denzel does a great job in that. I'd probably say it was loving basketball probably because I've seen it so many times with my sister and I really enjoyed the film. I guess my favorite was M Malcolm X. Malcolm X. That was one of my favorite. They're all my favorites. <laughs> because he's good. Inside Man, Denzel's in that one. That's always good. Mm -hmm. That's tonight. School days, I mean, we're Greek. Members of Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority Incorporated. Alpha so, yeah. definitely fave. He got game. He got game. Yeah, my favorite one. <laughs> Malcolm X. I mean, it's, it's a, I mean, it's a life story. And it's, you know, it just teaches everybody so much. So, that is one of my favorite movies of him. School days. And why is that? School Days is first a hilarious movie, and then it has singing in it. I'm a singer, so I'm like, okay, singing, great acting. Okay, come on, like, who can't love this movie? And I love Tisha Campbell. She's a wonderful actress, and it had a very, very powerful message. And if you could ask Spike Lee any question, what would that be? The question I would ask Spike Lee is, what is his favorite movie? that he's ever created. Out of all the movies he ever created, what's his favorite? I want to ask him about, I believe his latest movie that he's getting ready to produce is called Sam, mm -hmm. isn't that right? I, I'd want to ask him more in-depth questions about that, about the cultural part of that. Probably one question I would ask him that would be um, what his inspiration is or who his inspiration is, because I know he's, a, he's an inspirational figure to other people. So as far as even his movies or anything, his life, um, who inspires him? Um, is he taking photos with students? <laughs> he might be. <laughs> what his his influences with the movies, his movies are, and um, kind of what it was like transitioning into his movies in the 90s into like a thriller movie such as Inside Man. How was that and how was the transition with that? And I'm just looking forward to hearing his messages and inspiring words. Is there any type of project that 
he didn't get to do yet that he would like to when he before like he retires. Okay. Great question. Thanks so much for being here tonight. All right, thank you. Well, as you can see, the students, faculty, and staff at Murray State are so excited to host Spike Lee, and I'll be back in a moment speaking to you with Alicia. Well, Alicia, I don't know about you, but I was so excited and surprised at the turnout tonight. There were a lot of students who came to this event. I was surprised, too. There were a lot of faculty and staff who came and supported the event. It was just, it's been so exciting. And that movie, Inside Man, I mean, Denzel Washington, Jodie Foster, it's a great film. It's one of my favorites. Jodie Foster and Denzel Washington are two of my favorite actors of all time. So I really enjoyed the film. But I love so many of, of Spike Lee's films anyway. They're He's all one great. of my favorite directors. Now, Spike, if you have any upcoming films and you need some actresses, we're definitely willing to help you out. Hey, if you need an actor or a, a voiceover artist, my name's Alicia Carthel. Look me up on Google. And I'm Emily Ashby. Find me on Facebook. <laughs> <laughs> we so look forward to you coming next week. We will be there with students, faculty, and staff, and we welcome you to Murray State University. And this is us signing off with Colored Chronicles. Colored Chronicles. <laughs>